Hey guys, it's your boy and welcome back to my FIFA 17 Liverpool Grammar Well, that's not. That's a. Up. Up, well. I won't tell you why I'm at Massa. And because I'm gonna let you. It's who haven't seen the last episode. Go off and watch it yourself. Well, and if you have people or do not, then what the hell are you watching this video? Because you're just gonna be completely, completely confused. For those of you who know what's going on, of course you know that this is the this is the fourth game in the E group stage of the the Champions League for the second season. All I have to do is beat Galatasaray, and I will not only be qualified for the knockout stages, but I will be guaranteed first place. A lot of good football been played So, yeah. You're looking for consistency, aren't you, in these group stages? And uh, one or two teams have shown that already. I wonder if they can continue it here today. This is the team news for Galatasaray. Fernando Musleras. I can get to it, said Tom. But because Galatasaray are in second, and this will, and I went over to them and would take me out of the to reach in terms of points with two games remain. There you can see they're five points behind me already, so they're very quick in these breakaways. Really a, a draw wouldn't even be good as for guys that's right. Again the uh so uh, a win would be the best result for Amanda it's not gonna happen, especially if Moya doesn't miss, which he did. Now they'll be reflecting on a genuine wasted chance. Not sure what happened there. Moya's been pretty clinical in front of all this so far this season. Of course, this is the second game or against Galatasaray. Already beat him at Anfield, but of course. That means very little when it comes to this game. Good challenge here. They are. Oh, beautiful ball. Oh, for Henry. Hey, across the box. Oh, Henry Moore puts it in. And what happened there? A mass confusion at the back. Cost Galatas arrived big. The ball comes across the box to the fence. The, uh, it's actually Bruma. Bruma gets back. I think he, he's helping. Uh, he's cost the team. Oh, well, he slides the ball into the keeper. The loose ball all comes to Emery more. He's right in front of the goal with no one there to stop him. Or even challenge him. There's no one near him. So, he kicks the ball. Oh. Well, I mean, make it easier if you can. Freaking hell. I don't know how it... I've scored some easy goals in FIFA. I don't... I didn't... They almost always seem to find a way to get easier. That's what I say. Oh, that's one of the easiest goals that you're ever going to score. Some, another easy goal. Oh, oh as Moya makes it 2 0, knocking in and off the post. Off the post, goalkeeper absolutely beaten. No, it's a wonderful strike, really crisp effort. War is calling for the ball, but. The goal. Moy, I saw the opportunity to go himself, and he was well rewarded. A superb finish for his third of the competition. A 
Lavanda. Crisp defending there. Moya. Oh, that is a, a bad foul, but the referee is ignoring it. Here's the chance. But hey, hey, I'll take it if it means they score or goal number three with LeBlanc. I think it's probably pronounced. Probably not. It is looking pretty much now that the victory is assured. Oh, it's an enviable situation for them. Should be home. Keeper Musalera. I mean. Dude, trying to do something, except just jump. Ooh. It's a easy first goal for the club, for uh, the youngster. Liverpool putting on a masterclass here. Will be a throw. Oh, play. Fayor. Oh, I'm glad. Knocks it. It's 4 0. The second team is ripping in Galatasaray to shreds. I mean, this match is well and truly over. Or make no bones about it. Opposite number. It's a really yeah, good I am definitely going to be through. I am definitely going to finish top of the group. The Galatasaray fans are probably wishing EA had put in the some thing that allows them to leave. Because I bet they are, they are all wishing they could be absolutely anywhere else. But right here, right now, watching their team be absolutely utterly annihilated by a team in whose average age is pro he less than 20. I'd be surprised it's maybe 20 at max with how many youngsters they have in the team. Like, I'm pretty sure only three players are over 20 years old. That being Ragnar Clavin, Thiago Lori, and Cavaliera. And he's only just over it. He's like 21, 22. Looking to take the corner quickly. Moyas headers too much. I. And normally it does a point when a player misses is an easy opportunity, but on this occasion I'll let it slide because I'm absolutely fucking dominate. Milan are are going to stroll into second place as they are one nothing up and something. All they have to do is win. And they are in this second place. The second half of their fourth match, of course. Yeah, and two clubs that know what it takes to progress and uh, it's going to be an interesting matchup, this one. It may come down to who wins against between the two teams when they play. That looked promising. If and Milan aren't my next opponents. Well, it won't even matter if they are because I won't be playing that game. And he can clear it here. Throw him for Liverpool. Uh, Here's Emery Moore. The uh, qualification secured of the next to the next round. There's absolutely no reason for me to play the next the last two games. So, if possible, I'm going to assume. I say if possible. Well, I'll have to see here where they are. When I say in terms of, you know, video wise. Coming up on EA Sports for you. Our coverage of the Premier League fixture. Liverpool, they'll be facing Norwich City away from home. Yeah, I've had a lot of supporters 
get excited about it, and I am as well. Well, we're two thirds of the way through the 90 minutes, half an hour to go. Well, yeah, I could always cut it out of the video. Eren Dediok. Cavanda. Galatasaray given a free kick here. I have no idea what I did. I really don't. No idea where he stopped playing. He shouldn't have. So close with that. Oh, I wait, wait. It's the third score there. Pretty sure that's their first shot on my goal. It came from some bullshit. Wesley Snyder. Liverpool take over possession again. This could be a chance. He's through. Shots on here. Oh, what a, a finish. 5 0. Oh, well, Emre Moore scores his second of the game. And he will now be, be hunting a hat trick. Grab the second chance here. If you're losing count, it's 5 0. Because it goes from bad to worse for Gatasalai. Good strong tackle. This could be it. Moya, well, yeah, the us keeps adding on the misery. Now he's got his second of the game. Him, him, he's made it six. Well, That's also right. We're holding up hope oh, there for, for a bit, but I've broken them down again. Hmm. Moya has two, Moore has two, the team has six, and God's us or his players probably just want to go home. Unfortunately, there's about 15 minutes, not including, well, maybe ain't including stuff, it's time left! And Moya and Moore are both hunting hat tricks. Moya probably should already have his, to be honest. How many chances he's missed? But, um, it's not here nor there. He might be through. Moya, ah, uh, oh my gosh! He sliced that one. Even more if they end up losing this match. Six nil. That might well be the final score. There's not much time left. So this is, is going to have a devastating effect on the next game, isn't it? Well, Liverpool go up against Norwich City after this. The way they've played out here today, they'll be full of confidence, I think. It has been... Oh, Vlado avoids the challenge. Here's Emery Moore. The turn. Oh, and Bruma. Uh, makes up for his earlier mistake on the uh, first goal. Well, I guess to uh, deny a seventh. No fucking consolation it's going to be to the team. Well, I guess their confidence isn't going to be completely destroyed. I mean, it really should already be, but... Ah, uh, what can you do? Oh, more takes that. Too easy. Hey. I'm kind of bummed that Emery didn't get a hat trick in was his home country. But hey, what can you do? Six nil was the final score. Wow, Milan added two more goals in the second half to trounce Celtic three nil. Oh, they go second with five points. With two games left, they are looking good for that spot. Liverpool six, AC Milan. For God's sake! Of course, it's right between the games between Chelsea and Chelsea and Manchester United. 
Uh, of course it is. Yeah, what can you do? What can you do? Good, I see. Oh, oh wow, look at that. And Philip Coutinho has become my highest rated player. He is now 89 rated. Damn. And surprisingly, Larry's Carius has gone up to an 86 rated. So, for those of you wondering why I'm saying Hmm, surprisingly, you've not been watching Liverpool the past two games. The uh, well done, Phil. I like Coutinho. Oh, it's gone. Up so... Oh, man. Like, he was 85 when we started. He's 89 now. Sayamane. He... He has gone up to 82. The dude has 15 goals this season. He's in here. At 35, something like that, last season? What is. Oh, wait, Calabria is only 20 years old. <laughs> Freaking making him older than he is. So there's only two players in that team over 20 years. There's an age. I mean, you could throw Calabria in there if you're talking about 20 or over. Actually, I think that means Rico would... Yeah, Rico is 20 as well. By the way, one of the best swap deals ever. I mean, why would... Why, I don't know why Walks all accepted it, but they did. Fucking idiots. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I was um, checking on the group stage, because uh, I'm sure all of you all want to see what Milan's victory does mean. Any fucking day now! There it is. Let's see, group D, there it is. I mean, it's pretty much knocked Celtic out of the competition, which is a uh, sad times for them. And yeah, it really will come down to Galatasaray versus Milan, unless, I mean, unless Celtic beat Galatasaray and Milan beat me when I simulate the game. I mean... I'll be simulating with the second team, so we'll have a very good chance. If Celtic can somehow manage to beat Galatasaray, I mean, Milan would be on 8 points and they'd be through. Galatasaray have to win to send it to, uh, to put it to the last day. Hey. Hey. And that will negate whatever Milan do. So, uh, I'm so Celtic don't, and normally I, I like Celtic, but, you know, it would make the last game him that interesting, and if something is up for grabs, and it's the two teams fighting it out, they'll probably play to a draw, that's how it normally goes, <laughs> but that, that's not, that, that's not right here nor there, that's, down the road. Dewara and... Oh no wait, it's just Dewara looking to play. Chris Mensa wants more money. Um, I'll deal with that after the video. Oh, I'll Chelsea are back up into... Second place. Second place is changing hands more times than I you care to keep track. Chelsea are second, then I are second, then Arsenal are second, then Crystal Palace have been second. Everyone in the top five has been second at some point. Well, oh, except for me, because I've been first since day one. <laughs> Hey, 
Anyway, off the catalog to possibly, hopefully, get three more points and continue this amazing form. I mean, we are yet to draw points in the league because of that little uh, mess up with um. the same. Well, uh, if it's going to be that easy, why should we even bother? I mean, seriously. I know that's training and there was like only one defender. But is it gonna be that easy? I mean I hope not. I mean I kinda know it I do Hmm, what do I hope? I don't know. I don't know. I have to go Oh eleven for eleven. That's why I the home side will have to produce something special to break through this defence. Here is the Norwich City team for you today. Martin Olsen starts despite looking shaky in recent games. looking to recover his form. Eduardo Vargas is the main striker today. As I said, so far, throughout all last season and so far this season, I have not dropped one single point. I've won every single game. So this is for 49 consecutive league wins in a row. And Sayama, he says, let's get that ball rolling, shall we? He, with his 16th goal of this, he's, it is just, and that was immensely easy. I mean, now. Keeper gave himself no chance by coming out because as soon as Manny got the ball away from him, it was over. It's 1 0. Thank you very much. In midfield, they've got it back via an interception. Vargas, nicely played through ball, and it's a header, he's kept it out. Hey, they've responded in kind with a uh, attack of their own, although Carius comfortably saves it, which is somewhat of an odd thing to say, considering what has been happening recently. Again, I'm not going to go into it. Because if I do, I'll start ranting, and no one wants to hear me rant. I've, I've ranted enough on these videos. I'm not gonna rant anymore. I don't care. Here. Liverpool. Liverpool were good, now we're shit. Circle of fucking life complete. Well, here comes the support. I mean, I thought we were gonna have our bad period when. The likes of Sa Sam Mane would be a way of the uh, African combinations in January. But no, 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 Christmas time is here, which means Liverpool turned to fucking shit. Seriously. Coutinho. Like I said, I'm not, I'm not going to go into it, because I'm always angry. He, he. If I go in, any more into it. I'm not going to be able to stop myself. Safety first there. The team have some work to do um, because they've lost their last two games. They've got home advantage. They, they need to win today. Yeah, they do. Put the pressure on them in front of their own fans. Manny. Beautiful ball for Daniel Sturridge. Terrible miss, Daniel Sturridge! 
getting the accolades for such a wonderful breakaway goal. <laughs> oh dear, he's embarrassed now. Oh, he'll get some stick from his team. Even my avatar is like, what the fuck? He's lost the ball. Dude. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Oh, just worried about the rain only in that it's uh, impairing a bit our visibility of the proceedings out there on the pitch. Yeah, we're nice and dry up here, but uh, unlike the players. Uh, Come on, win that. Win that, Matip. Yes. It's courage. A real chance here. Sturridge. Oh, good save from Ruddy. Coutinho! Forces in another corner, this time on the opposite side. For me, you know, King clears for another corner. For the corner. The shot's on! Oh, Imagine if I can produce something. To be honest, I was expecting a better hit. Well, it is Liverpool's match at this point, but there's a lot more of it still to go. And Dude. They're good to see this through. Plenty of time left. All Third, the poor first touch. They took it away from him. That's it. Can. Firmino. Money. Oh my. He liked. position here looking to play his teammate through and he goes for goal with his Chan, there we go oh Emery Chan with a powering header or finally makes it 2-0 after toyous amount of bullshit misses I was actually starting to wonder if that second goal was ever going to come and somehow that is his first goal of the season. At this point, he had already gotten a few last season. I mean, hell, he scored the first goal of the whole career mode overall last season. In the first game against Arsenal. Good forward play from them. He's taken on his man and beaten him. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looks very... No, referee, ju no, ju just fucking ignore the obvious fucking foul. I mean... It, it's okay to impede the run now, is it? Because last time I checked, that was against the fucking rules. Well, they've got a lead to hang on to the away team here, and they're trying to do it. I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know how the computer can let itself get away with blatantly breaking the fucking rules. It's complete bullshit. Oh, but of course! Don't be a cop. Fuck you! Absolutely fuck you! Look again, Alan, at this, the slide tackle that went wrong. Well, he's tried to go for the slide tackle, and uh, he's a faction off getting the ball. It is a foul. And they cut it out. Yusuf Malumbo. Asshole. Not giving freaks. He's not, he's not paying attention, not following the rules, 
Those giving bullshit yellow hearts. Oh my gosh. My blood is absolutely fucking boiling. Coming up for you on EA Sports. Don't forget. Chan. Whips in. Of course, there's nobody there. Of course, there's nobody fucking there. Supporters get excited. Why would there be? Why would there be? That's a stupid. It, it moronic. It, you know, common sense. That's just, you know, moronic common sense coming into play again. And, oh, fuck off, common sense. You, you, you're not common. Fuck off. Who, who needs you? Fuck off. Just, just fuck off. Because no one, no one, no, no one needs you. No one cares about you. Because it's clear by the reaction. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Pay attention. Pay attention for once in your pathetic little fucking lives, you dumb pieces of fucking pixels. Nathaniel Klein. Feels like I'm watching a real match. They're too stupid to put the ball in the net. Well, the goals to games ratio for Daniel Sturridge, exceptional. I mean, how hard was that? How hard was that? I ran through the defense. It should be always that easy. I mean, that's not even legendary. That's not even legendary. That's just bullshit. That's given them a comfortable. This should be about 17 nothing. Bullshit has said, you know what? No. No, it's not going to be. Uh, this the scoreline is not going to represent ain't your dominance, Corey. It's just going to uh, show oh, that yes, you were the better team. Yes, you got the three points. Yes, you picked up the win. But is it going to re truly reflect your dominance? Not really. I mean, it'll it'll kind of reflect it. Decided it's just a throw after the tackle. Coutinho. Firmino! Great header, great save! Oh, nothing but... Uh, nope, not gonna properly. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to say about that. I really don't. I know he can't play right back, but... It's not even important. It's just getting them on. So they can get the chunk change minutes. So the board can be happy and they can stop deducting me rating points for no fucking reason, which is another bullshit feature of this game, and which is happening to me for the second time. I don't know why. I'm not doing anything wrong except winning. Hmm? Apparently, that's a fucking issue with the board. I don't know what the fuck they're watching because I'm 49 out of 49 in the league. Forward with some danger to what the more do these fucking assholes want? What, what more do they want? 49 from 49. And it's not good enough. Easily clear. This video cannot end soon enough. It's not that I'm not enjoying playing the big. It's just. I am absolutely fucking sick of the bullshit. He's coming forward with some danger. Thank God it's over. Crystal Palace picked up another one. You watch me. It's they go up the table again. United 2, Northampton Town 1. Oh my fucking god! 75! 75! Why? Why did my rain go down? The motherfuckers! What? What did I do? What did I actually do? Tab on the league standings. At the top of the table remain Liverpool with 33 points. In second, Chelsea. Critical. I'm winning the Premier League. I'm first in the fucking table. I'm on my. I'm, I'm qualified for the next 
stage in the group stage. I can't reach the final of the FA Cup. The FA Cup doesn't start until Feb until January. Hey, hey. Working on that 100%, 34%. What more do you want? What more do you want? city with 16 points. I don't understand. Somebody, please, un help me understand. Why has my rating gone now? My rating was 90 plus at the end of last season. 49 league wins in a row over two seasons, and it has gone down to 75. Can somebody explain that? Because I'm going to be the most. I'm going to be the manager. I'm going to be the first manager to lose his job for winning games. Yep, that makes perfect fucking sense. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Maybe in the next episode, with the bullshit will stop for my game. No, I fucking won't. And just come back to see the train wreck continue. Until next time, hope you all have a very nice day. Peace.